We know that people's purchasing decisions are motivated by deep-seated needs and desires, but there's something else that drives the decision to buy. Personal values. In other words, the things people care about when pursuing the things they want. For example, imagine someone trying to fulfill one of their most fundamental human needs, nutrition. As she looks over the potato chip options in the grocery store, there are different values that can sway her purchasing decision. If she cares about affordability and popularity, she'll go for the cheapest big-name brand. If she appreciates healthiness and sustainability, she'll choose the organic local brand. Each value can be paired with a mirror opposite. Together, they form the two extremes of a spectrum. For example, think of riskiness and dependability, casualness and professionalism, old-fashionedness and trendiness, speediness and methodicalness. If you want to play it safe as a marketer, you can try to stake out either the middle ground between these values or one of the more popular extremes, like affordability. After all, those are the places where most people can be found. But these safe spots are where most companies are trying to market their products. As a result, the competition is fierce. If your company is a startup, it can be difficult to get your message heard above the din. To find your smallest viable market, the more effective approach is to move out to the extremes that haven't been overcrowded yet. Even better, stake out a unique combination of extremes. You can even link opposite extremes together. That's part of what the Grateful Dead did to become one of the most commercially successful rock bands in history. 